I legit rage quit yesterday because of that stupid disconnection. Like, I was already so close on beating the final chapter on the first world, the Namek one. But all of a sudden, <laughs> I got disconnected. But anyway, I just found a new code, so I'm just gonna put it here. All right, um, yeah, I think that there's nothing for us to do. Let me just check what we can summon. Because we have like 150 gems now. Oh, Yusuke, Frieza, and that blonde dude. Forgot. Yeah, I'm really sorry, guys, that I cannot name most of the anime characters here. But yeah, that's the good thing. Because you guys might be the reason why I will start to watch a new anime. Alright? So if you have any anime recommendation, just drop it down in the comment section below. I just want to try Deku because, I mean, I already know that I can do the final chapter on the first one the namek one here the true supreme power frieza boy this frieza thought that he can escape me well i still have a bunch of cash here well not really a bunch but i mean there's no chance look at that <laughs> pain's range is really a pain i really love the four star pain can't wait to get like a five star pain soon there you go easy peasy i'm loving this mount Kind of like a floating wheelchair. <laughs> Alright, we are now in the first chapter here on the Leaf Village. So we are now going to Naruto's world. Ooh, this map is bigger than I expected. Oh, hold up. Alright, this is the enemy spawn. There's something weird about this map though. Look, 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 look. Uh, cool. Alright, this is the... Yeah, this one, this one. There's like a crossroads here. I'm not sure, I'm just gonna pick... Maybe I'm guessing that they're going to the left side. I don't know, if they will go to the right side, I'll be doomed. Please, left, turn left, turn left, turn left, turn left... Ugh, okay, he was like, nope. I think my army composition is not really that bad. The boss is almost like 1.4k after it passed the, the fiery attacks of that first unit, but... Yeah, all I'm gonna do here now is just gonna sell my other units and add some more units here. Yeah, we should be fine here. Well, I'm not sure actually. I am not sure. I'm not used to the controls here. I mean, my mouse sensitivity, guys, since I'm playing FPS games, my mouse sensitivity is always so low. So, you guys can see that I am putting my mouse pointer from the bottom of your screen up until to the top right corner well whenever i'm doing that i'm literally swiping my mouse all the way to the other side of my table so <laughs> yeah that's the reason why i'm clicking slow i'm just no longer comfortable on using faster mouse sensitivity and i also don't want to you know mess up my aim whenever i'm playing c well not really csgo but yeah it's just it's just because of that game actually all right, oh, man, I think that we we will actually fail this one. Boy, 300 only. I'm running out of space and I'm running out of money as well. Oh, bruh, why can't I put the, oh, I need to sell. No! Yo, 192, for real? What? Boy, I was so overconfident, GG. We are exactly at the same position as the previous run, but I'm deciding to put more mob than Ichigo because mob has a range, even though its damage is not really that big, but considering the range itself, I, I think that maybe we can try to see if its damage output would be more than what Ichigo has. All right, I'm just gonna sell this one. And I really suggest for you guys to use this as well because not everyone got like five star characters, all right? And on tower defense, the beauty of the game tower defense is all about mixing and kind of like finding the right ingredient for a certain tower, all right? Sometimes it's also gonna be about the boss, but all in all, that's the good thing about this kind of games, all right? It's so... Uh, finding the right choices, finding the right units for you to play with because, you know, it's also based a little bit on luck. Okay, I swear. Are we gonna fail this again? Boy! Uh, the boss got like 197 HP again. 
I replaced Pain to Kid Naruto because for the previous run, I didn't really use Pain at all. I mean, Pain is really a good one, but the problem is the terrain, all right? I cannot write, like uh, utilize its range, so Kid Naruto saved our day for this dungeon. But yeah, that was really a good one. Ooh, Kakashi is here. Let's try if I can get that. Oh, Naruto Sage Mode. Hmm. Oh, two seconds. Attack with 12 damage. All right, not bad. Range is good as well. Okay, let's try another one. Oh boy, this bald guy. Krillin! Oh, two seconds. Oh wait, wow, that range though. All right, let's try another one. Oh boy, another Naruto. But at least we're getting reds. And another red. Okay, to the Roki. Oh, we got some snow squid here. I mean, he's only level 8, so... Would have been partied with him. I brought back Pain because I think that using Kid Naruto is fun and all, but... I, I find it really boring because it's kind of like a spammy-ish type of gameplay, and I really don't like that. I still wanted to see if I can turn around Pain to a more useful unit here, but man... Ah, I just cannot utilize his whole range. All right, look at this, guys. I didn't use any pain at all, and look at my units. <laughs> so many mob and also Ichigo, and the fun thing is they're both wearing color black, so they really fit each other, and I think that these two cards are these two units that I'm using, especially Ichigo is one of those easiest version of those cards that you can just really spam. Well, not really spam, but of course you really need to to think of where to place it, where to best place it. But yeah, its damage is not really that OP, but as you guys can see, the boss didn't even manage to cross the bridge. Alright, that was GG. Oh, I wanna get Nami, 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 Nami. Aw, uh, oh wait, Mega Rare, okay! This ugly one, Jinbei, from One Piece. Oh, we got another Snow Squad here. Gen base stats, oh, six seconds, 24 Bruh. damage. OMG, I'm gonna be reported for being fake. <laughs> Report me a hundred times, please. All right, third stage, here we go. Jinbei at max is a, an AOE unit, but the range is really small. However, the damage is really OP as well. So yeah, I think that it also slows down enemy-ish. I'm not sure, but... Yeah, you guys can see the attack, the color blue circle. This is legit the ugliest boss that I've seen in this game. I'm sure- Well, I know that this is like from the anime itself, but yeah, it's just really Bruh. ugly. Alright, I think that the boss will now go down here. I got a ton of cash here. $6,000. Just gonna spam this melee units that I have. But yeah, I mean, this is already finished. And yeah, that's that's my style. Sell and spam. <laughs> Alright, come on. Are you still not finished? Alright, there you go. Alright, we got rid of that ugly looking boss. And we got a sound ninja too. Not bad. Oh, pain in the trigon and also Killua. Oh, I want to get this. At least one red. And of course the game will say no. Alright, let's now go to the fourth stage. Demon's Flute. Alright, he looks like my thumb. Same old, same old. It's always about the boss. And look guys, this is what I'm doing. I'm always waiting here on the entrance so that once those units can no longer reach the boss, like they're no longer attacking, you can now just sell them because literally they're, they're worthless anyway. So just, you know, just so you can get ton of cash in return even though yeah technically you will lose some of your cash but i mean there's no uses for them anyway so yeah that's the reason why i'm just going to put some more here this is a good thing if the map is really long it, it's it's your advantage as well because literally the pathway is longer so it means that you have more time and i think that this is already good enough well, I'm just gonna add some more, but the boss is already almost dead. Look at that, 500 plus across the bridge, and he will be greeted by my mobs. Let me just sell this, this. Oh boy, look at my cash. $6,000. Always, as always, as always. I already tried Krillin, but I think that mob is better than him, so. All right, GG. That thumb boss is already dead. 
So far, we still do not have any humps. So we're now going to the fifth one, Bone Dance. All right, we're gonna face Grandpa. I brought back Kid Naruto because I am expecting that this boss is gonna be like a little bit more OP than the previous bosses. Man, Kid Naruto is really OP. Well, it's not really, really OP, but if you will know how to use and how to utilize its potential, man, look at that. Didn't even sniff that bridge at all. All right, that's GG, and we got another Sound Ninja too. Time to pull some cards again. Nami's here again. I just want Nami. No, not you, Luffy! All right, this is gonna be our last chapter here for the Leaf Village. And this should be easy unless that white snake... This is Orochima, right? Well, I might be wrong. All right, seems as the boss is just a regular boss with a tanky HP. And uh, yeah, I think that I can just sell this. Yeah, this is... This strategy is really OP. Oh boy, he's now approaching the bridge. Huh. You will be welcomed by my mobs. And also those Naruto spawns, like, they're now so tanky as well. You gotta soak up those damage. There you go. Let me put another one here. Okay, oh, alright. 200 plus. He's gonna go down. GG. Alright. See you later, alligator. Well, live village is done. And we got another Sound Ninja 3. This world is easy.